An important update for our customers from Target. Dear customer, today you may have heard about changes that have been announced regarding the future of Target. As a result of these changes, a number of our stores will be leaving the Target family. Some of these stores will be converting to Kmart, and sadly, some will be closing. The majority of these changes will happen next year. That was an email I received from the Managing Director of Target Australia a couple of days ago. Target is Australia's largest department store chain by store number, but that's soon to change. Target has just become the latest casualty in Australia's ailing retail sector. Owners of Target, West Farmers, announced that up to 75 stores will be closed across Australia, while about 90 stores will be converted to Kmart. Yes, West Farmers also own Kmart. It turns out that Target and Kmart, although competitors, are actually just sister companies. Whether you buy stuff from Target or Kmart, West Farmers certainly don't care. They get your money either way. But as it turns out, Aussies prefer Kmart. It's cheaper, it's more affordable, and its prices are lower. Yes, Aussies love a bargain, and Kmart has successfully delivered that bargain. For example, looking at Lego, we can see that the Harry Potter Hogwarts Express is $139 at Target, but only $119 at Kmart. For the LEGO City Mars Research Shuttle, it's $49 at Target, but only $39 at Kmart. Generally speaking, when it comes to retail, price wins. And when you're selling the same product, of course price wins. Who's going to pay the extra $20 at Target to buy the Hogwarts Express? Nobody, I would hope unless they've only got Target in their city. I don't know how West Farmers run their department store business, but I can't believe for a second they believed that this sort of price differential could go on for much longer. Of course Target was going to fail if they're selling exactly the same products at a significantly higher price. West Farmers Managing Director Rob Scott commented on the restructuring. Unfortunately, the disruptive and competitive nature of the retail sector requires us to make some hard decisions to ensure we have a viable target business into the future, while continuing the strong growth of Kmart and Catch. Retail strategist Brian Walker said that Kmart has just become more likeable to consumers than Target. He said, Kmart in Australia has a great success story in the rise of chic and cheap. Kmart has a story. It's getting pretty cool to have something from Kmart. The overarching piece is that customers vote with their wallets. I think Target just got vanilla. It just got pedestrian. Anyway, that was my little commentary on Target. In the end, if you sell something for a higher price than Kmart, Kmart wins.